Good morning. The thing that's on my mind this morning is the struggle that entrepreneurs have when we are asked to do work for free. A lot of times this ask comes with the promise of exposure, which may or may not actually be the case because the only exposure that matters to your business is if it's exposure to your ideal clients where there's a high probability that they're going to buy your products or services. If that's not the case, exposure doesn't do you any good at all. And so for me and my business, I'll tell you how I manage requests for free work. First of all, I don't do a whole lot of it. I'm very select and I only do free work where I want to give back. So I'll give you an example. I had someone reach out to me with a request to speak to high school girls about quieting their inner critic. And that was a hell yes for me because that group of young women need to get that message more than anybody else. Were they likely to buy my products and services? No, they weren't. And it fits very tightly with my mission of helping kind and ambitious women dream bigger and reach further. So that was a yes for me. When I'm asked to do free talks, I will occasionally do them. I, I recently did a talk for the Alliance of Technology and Women. I'm on the board of directors. Again, it's aligned with my mission. And I generated a lot of income off of that one talk because it truly was my ideal audience. So when you get asked for free work as an entrepreneur, think about, is this my ideal audience? Are these people likely to buy from me? And is it directly tied to my mission for my products and services. And if you're someone who has historically asked entrepreneurs to work for free, please try to find a budget to pay them. These professionals are working hard to grow a business and make a living, and they need our support in order to do that. If you absolutely don't have a budget, put together a value package for them that is compelling. It could be testimonials. It might be mentioned in the, all of these things, by the way, not one, <laughs> you know, testimonials, a mention in their program, you know, send out a link to the, the social media sites for your, the person who's doing work for you to engage, uh, give them referrals, put together a strong package so that the work that they're doing for you translates into revenue for them being very, very careful about the free work that we do give and asking for the value we deserve, well, this is how we rise.